Hello everybody, welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker HD in the last episode of The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker HD. <laughs> I just said Wind Waker HD twice. But we killed the Helmorok King right there. And in this episode, we are going to go to Ganon's like, castle, I think? No, or little hideout up here. And I'm Mungo Took, and I'm the Let's Player slash commentator of this Let's Play. Let's hop right in. So you walk in here with your sword thinking you can kill Ganondorf. But he just watched the bird die right in front of you. Or right in front of him. Or all of the above. And now he since he didn't have the bird. I think he can. I'm breathing. Oh no. She's got the sword. Yep, yep. No, not the sword. <gasps> no! The blade of evil. The blade of evil. Yep, the blade of evil. It's Spain. It's basically what he's telling us. <laughs> his face. But basically what he's telling us is that his sword can't kill Ganon because... What do you call it? Uh, what do you say? Uh... It's been sealed, so no one can destroy it. Or it's been sealed away because what happened? Uh, yeah, they sealed it so only the true hero could wield it. Haha. <laughs> and then he's just like, my sword's bigger. And it's just like, no. <laughs> What a pirate. Link, get up. Um, I think that's child abuse right there. Ganon, I'm gonna to have to call uh the authorities. But 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 bah I like those eyebrows, Ganon. Where'd you get them? I like how he only has two teeth, the top row and the bottom one. Like, you can see there's no teeth other than that. But, actually, um, Trifolus is magical. I don't know what was that. Oh, yeah. Uh, Rudo, whatever you want to call them, Tri. Shows up and rescues them. Get ready. You don't know what Dragon Fire is like. We need Bofa King. We need all the Bowman. And then, wow, he catches on fire. Postman saves Link. Uh, I actually didn't notice that the postman saved Link. I thought it was just uh, another person from the Rito tribe. So, now you're greeted with a fairly long cutscene. Like the birds flying. I don't know why they didn't just drop them off on the pirate's boat, but... I don't know why. But... Sucking with the great value. I'm not. I don't know what it says. Help me. Oh no. Well, technically, couldn't have Link just grappled hooked onto his tail because he doesn't really use his tail that much. But, Great Valley is gone. <laughs> Same with the Rio. But, now. Let's go back in to Hyrule to show Tetra slash Princess Zelda where to go. Well, I wonder how long they were out for. Like, actually, because. Or how she was out for. Wait, what? Why couldn't the King of Red Lions just turn around and talk? But 
but I guess not. I don't know why, but then we uh, have to leave the boat. It's too deep. I can't swim. I'm sorry. Oh no. Follow me. Let's see. Is she stuck? Oh, she is stuck. Oh. You don't want to get her stuck, because that's just something. So, we are now in the Hyrule Castle. And she's still coming. Yep. Wee. Yep. Can, okay, good, she can jump. <laughs> her face when I just dropped in. So, auto, whatever. Oh no! Who could that be? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Who made it? The royal family gossip stone? Then I know who you are. You are. I don't know. Who are you? <laughs> oh no. The king? Oh, he's the king of the lions. Yes, everyone, that is true. He is actually the king of red lions, but also the king of Hyrule, I guess. And he's the one who made the whatever stone. The the Navi stone, that's what I'm going to call it. But you know, they're called the Gossip Stone, but the Navi Stone sounds better because it's annoying just like Navi. And what do you call it? It tells you that the world has been sunken underwater because the great evil could, can't get underwater. And so that all the islands and stuff are mountaintops, but I'm kind of confused because then that means the Tower of the Gods is just floating. And I am unsure how that works, because how can it just float? And it's probably like four tons. Four tons. It's probably way heavier than that, but it's probably way heavier. Like, super heavy. Mesmerized. Turn off the high beams. I'm pretty sure this should be confidential to Link because he could be a blabbermouth. Princess Zelda? Oh no! Arr, I'm a pirate Zelda. Not Princess Zelda. I'm the pirate. <gasps> One, two, four. She has weird fingers. Oh, okay, there's five. My fate. You are the true heir to the royal family of Hyrule, the last link in the bloodline. Are you sure? Oh, okay. You are princess. Then why don't you look at Link, Zelda? I'm a princess? I want to get scurvy like the pirates. Well, Zelda, you can't have everything. You should have got scurvy before you realized you were a princess. But... What? Drop the butt. And then, Link, you must leave. And then, get ready. If this is close, to, yeah. Yes. So now, what they told him is that you have to go to the temples to make the Master Sword, the true Master Sword, not just the Master Sword that's not fully mastered. I guess it's I guess you'd call it the Master Sword that's not fully mastered because it doesn't have the what do you call it? The I keep forgetting what it's called. But it doesn't have the Man, that's gonna kill me. It doesn't have the two other parts to the Master Sword, that's what I meant to say. But we have to go to the temples to get them reborn. Because the legendary s s songs that we have to learn are there. And it goes to the Earth and Wind Temple we must go next. And we will have a fun time. 
like we're not even gonna leave her food down there. Um, kind of confused. So Link made it up just in time before it closed. That's uh, interesting. Good job, Gin or Link. And now we gain control. Zelda, come back! But now we just wait a second. It said that this was a legendary hideout or whatever, that no one else would find it, but there's these marks on the ground when they show that you just have to slide that. That's flaws in the system. But we are going to return to the surface. If I can Ah uh, just yawn right while I jump. That's that's great. So let's talk about the north and east south temple. The north one is the wind temple, the south one is the earth temple. And then we can what do you call it? Start by dun 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 we can start by going out of the Hyrule Field, or <laughs> Hyrule Field. Hyrule Fields? No, this is not Hyrule Fields. No, but this is, what do you call it, Hyrule Castle, so... We left it, and now it closed forever until we can collect all seven or eight shards of the Triforce that lie in the Great Sea, but yeah. It's basically all we need. So, I think I'm going to end it here. Thanks for watching, everybody. This is Mungo Tooth. See you in the next episode of The Legend of Zelda of Wind Waker 